let's review the numbers uh, for today versus last week. Uh, we have an increase of 521 positive tests. We're up to 9,646 positive tests. We had a decrease in the number of active cases in the community. They were down 482, and the active case count is now 1,895. We have 7,685 cases that have recovered, and we have 22 uh, people that are hospitalized currently, and that's the same as it was last week. But in between here, we had some days where we were up to 32 or 37 people in the hospital. So this number is, uh, is not overburdening our hospitals at this time. We have a total of 66 deaths now, and uh, we have a total of 37, 144 negative tests. The trajectory of the numbers is down 42% this week. So at this time, we've reduced the strain on our hospital admissions. We are 11 days after Thanksgiving, so contact with a positive case during family celebrations could still show up in the next few days. When the numbers come in next week, we can really say that we did a good job and made it through the holiday without a spike in our numbers. The Wisconsin National Guard testing site completed 178 tests on Wednesday and another 143 tests on Friday. This is the lowest number of tests administered recently. The Sheboygan County uh, uh, Public Health Department has reapplied for the National Guard to continue to have community testing through March of 2021. The testing uh, in December will continue on Wednesdays and Fridays at the Sheboygan County Aging and Disability Resource Center in Sheboygan Falls. There will be no testing on Friday, December 25th on Christmas Day, nor on Friday, December 31st, New Year's Eve. If you're referring someone to this site, please ask them to please pre-register and register at register.covidconnect.wi.gov and uh, traffic uh, slows substantially down uh, beginning at noon with the National Guard uh, comes each day with uh, 400 tests to, to administer. The CDC re released options to reduce quarantine uh, times for persons exposed to a positive contact. These options will reduce the time from 10 to 14 days in certain conditions. Please see the CDC notice for more information. Sheboygan County is still at a very critically high level. Uh, it's strongly recommended that we avoid going to places where safety measures are not in place, to wash our hands with soap and water or use hand sanitizer, especially after touching frequently used items or surfaces, to always wear a mask in public, to disinfect used items and surfaces as much as possible, and if you're sick, stay home and do not go to work or school.